Hi guys, hope you're all okay. Um, this is just a quick video. Um, stop. Hi guys, hope you're all okay. This is just a video because I wanted to, to discuss um, why I won't be um, doing any allotment or gardening videos or any probably any fishing ones or anything like that for the next month. Um, basically, the end of last year I applied for a scholarship with FSDP uh, that's a charity flying scholarships for the disabled people uh, and they basically help people who um, have had a long term ambition to fly people who never thought they'd be able to fly people who have had knockbacks uh, you know being told they can't fly uh, anyone basically with a disability and also people that have an interest in flying and for whatever reason uh, didn't have the confidence to go and do it uh, themselves and uh, they help basically get people in the air uh, people like myself who uh, if I'd have been uh, able-bodied and uh, not had all my issues <laughs> I'd have uh, either quite liked to have joined the RAF um, something that uh, the young me uh, was really keen on doing and it, you know got to a point in my uh, well just before my teens really when I realized that that wasn't going to be possible so yeah so uh, I applied for a scholarship last year and uh, thankfully and and massively honoured that I was given the scholarship and I start that uh, this September uh, I start that in uh, in a few days time so I um, <laughs> I'm uh, massively excited at the moment um, I, I can't explain the feelings I'm going through it's just it's not like anything I've been through before it's not like excitement of going on holiday excitement of going to a music festival excitement of going to the football it's like you know, excitement of having a child. Even it's it's like all of that just com compacted together into some kind of emotional roller coaster. Where I just, you know, by this point next week, well, by this point in in about four four days time, I'll have been in an aeroplane and I'll be flying it. You know, and being taught how to fly it. So it's crazy. Um, you know, I I feel. Like I said before, I, I feel massively honoured, and you know, not everyone gets these opportunities, and I'm hugely grateful. Um, but it's like, uh, it, what it is, it's a dream come true for me. It's a massive, massive thing. Um, this also might help explain the uh, dodgy moustache. It's not my usual uh, choice in facial hair. I've normally just got a bit of stubble going on, uh, but I thought. Well, if there's a uh, chance to get in the air, uh, and there's a, a chance to get in the air with a uh, big old style of moustache, then I should go for it, really. So yeah, so I've been ever since I found out uh, that I uh, was getting my scholarship, I started to grow uh, the tash. <laughs> so uh, this will be my RAF <laughs> styled moustache. Uh, it's just a bit of a bit of a joke with myself, really. Um, yeah, you know, I've got a big love of of history, and especially like World War Two, and the Battle of Britain. I think again, it comes from my love of aeroplanes and always wanting to fly. Um, so yeah, I thought, well, if I'm going to fly, then I'm going to fly with a tash. So I apologise for all the months of you watching me weed my allotment and do everything else with this hideous moustache. Um, but yeah, <laughs> that's why I've got it. So my plan for the next uh, few weeks will be to document my flying. So um, uh, the videos, uh, they'll probably be short and to be perfectly honest they'll probably be unedited because uh, I'm just not going to have time to sit there and edit them at, uh, and to be honest, you've seen my editing skills, they're not that great anyway. Um, most of my better videos just come straight off the cuff uh, talking to you guys. So uh, what I will do is I will document as much of learning to fly as I can um, and film it, get it up on YouTube, a uh, bit of a progression and um, hopefully it's of interest to some of you, uh, you never know, maybe it will inspire a few of you guys out there to get in touch with FSDP um, and this is my high vis jacket so yeah get in touch with the FSDP uh, if you have a disability and you've got an interest in flying or if you just think it's a really good cause and you basically want to help them out in some way um, you know whatever they need I know they have a uh, 
um, a monthly raffle uh, and other things and I'm sure as the weeks go on I will mention more about that um, but you know it's been already I haven't even been in an aeroplane yet well I haven't been in an aeroplane off the ground um, uh, with FSTP and I already feel so good about lots of different things in my life uh, just the whole process of um, going through this, going and getting the scholarship writing the application form uh, going to RAF Cranwell and um, having all the assessments and the medicals and stuff, meeting people. Uh, you know, I've seriously met some guys that I know I'm going to talk to forever uh, from, you know, from FSTP. Uh, it was just, it was a, the process of getting the scholarship was, was great. It was, it was really, really good. Uh, it was, from my personal point of view, it was really nice to be around other disabled people. Um, might sound strange that, but um we don't tend to do that well i didn't tend to do that as a disabled person it was like no i'm you know i may don't need to be involved in anything like that blah 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 I'll just soldier on along this that and the other kind of a little bit ashamed about my own disability to be honest and but since since i've um been um on the whole process of getting scholarship and i've met other people with disabilities it's i've, I've just just kind of accepted it really and you know I've put the little disability hashtag on my Twitter and I'm quite happy to you know rock the blue badge kind of thing you know um, as the lost voice guy comedian says I'm uh, just in it for the parking <laughs> and uh, I quite like that tongue-in-cheek attitude to disability and I mean it's nothing to be ashamed of um, and you know like I said the whole process through with FSTP has really helped me already and I haven't even flown yet uh, so so yeah uh, I hope you enjoy the next few weeks uh, like I said don't expect anything highly edited it's just going to be me in front of the camera uh, as today um, I'm just in front of my laptop at home uh, watching the uh, transfer deadline day over my shoulder big Liverpool fan so uh, <laughs> yeah I'm sure that's probably put off at least half of you um so yeah so um stay stay keep posted uh, i'll keep you posted how i get on um and uh, hopefully i will speak to you very very soon uh and uh, yeah thanks again and thanks to everyone who subscribes uh yeah it means a lot that just a few of you uh, like my page and are happy to listen to me rabbit on about all these different things so uh, uh speak soon until then all the best See you later, guys.